Today, we are going to talk about spatial processing with SAP HANA. As you know, SAP HANA is not just a database, it's a platform. It's a platform for developing and deploying high-value, high-performing, in-real-time solutions. SAP HANA has many different powerful capabilities, and we are going to focus on native spatial processing, where a special engine has been natively added to the powerful and flexible SAP HANA platform. But firstly, what is spatial data? Spatial data, or geospatial data, describes the position, shape, and orientation of objects in a defined space. It is represented as two-dimensional geometries in the form of a point, line between two points, and polygons or multi-polygons. The example image here shows the state of Massachusetts in the US and it is made up of a group or union of polygons and each polygon represents a zip code region. So spatial data can allow us to view and represent geographical features, latitude and longitude coordinates and movement of data. We have applications that can address the what, when, why and how type questions and spatial processing applications can address the where type questions that are location related. It can be as simple as where can I find the best Mexican food in Miami and how can I get there? Or more specifically in business, we can address location related questions such as what is the most direct delivery route? Or locating issues with a gas pipeline needing maintenance? Or where can I locate bin location X in IKEA for example? Or how can I represent the top five sales locations by country, state or city? I am now going to show you a very simple SAP HANA spatial app using spatial processing with SAP HANA, which allows you to visualize SAP Business One data, for example, in a graphical context, given data shape and form, which is represented in real time. Spatial processing with SAP HANA improves the value of business data and brings together business data. We've logged in to our spatial demo environment using our HANA credentials. You can log in from any kind of browser or device or from within the menu in SAP Business One. I am using Google Chrome for this example. We have two scenarios that contain spatial data. As we mentioned before, we can store in SAP HANA any type of shape that could potentially represent a geo map, such as the shape of a country or city, for example. And this kind of geo quantum data is already available in HANA, making it very easy to develop this geospatial integration with SAP Business One or any type of business application. Under business partner detail, if I'm a sales manager, Rather than browsing my business partners in the traditional manner individually via Business Partner Master Data in Business One, for example, I would like to view the spread of my business partners in a geographical layout. Here I can actually see the spread of my business partners in Europe. And if I select, for example, my business partner in France, on the right hand side, I'm actually presented with a comprehensive overview of the customer's details such as year-on-year -year spend or contact details, for example. All of these details can be customised based on your specific requirements. The second scenario supports the ability to view a geographical-based sales analysis rather than the traditional sales analysis presented in Crystal Reports or on a dashboard view. So if I want to view a sales analysis by country, I can simply select the country that I'm interested in. Let's select the US, for example. I can then select the level of detail I would like to view the sales analysis. So level one, for example, is country. And if I want to view my details by state, I can select level two. I then can select, for example, or drill down to the year that I'm interested in viewing my data for. So in this example, let's have a look at what our sales analysis was back in 2008. What we can see here is a concentration of sales by state. The darker the shade, the greater the concentration of sales activity revenue. I can click on the shaded areas, for example, in Pennsylvania and view the sales revenue or gross profit in detail. It ranks the state and under action, it highlights the top 10 business partners in this state, which may prompt you to plan 
any sales activities in this area going forward. You have the flexibility to choose your shading colour scheme or sales details which are all configurable with the app. Likewise, we can go and click on the state of California and we can see the sales amount, the gross profit, its ranking and again the top 10 customers that you may want to plan an action around those specific customers moving forward. Let's have a look at spatial processing with SAP HANA and its unified platform in more detail. SAP HANA Spatial Processing supports native OCG compliant spatial data types. That means you can store, process and retrieve various data types of spatial data. In addition to storing the spatial data, SAP HANA also has the ability to perform spatial processing, which means you can ask questions of the spatial data. For example, you can analyse the spatial data or ask an entirely new set of questions with a new and precise location dimension. SAP HANA also supports the interaction of spatial data using native calculation models and views. For example, you can quickly create spatial solutions using a flexible and powerful HANA analytic attribute and calculation view. As with other data types, we continue to store the data in a columnar table, and this means we can continue to leverage the high scanning and analytic performance capabilities of SAP HANA. In addition to the real-time high performance capabilities, we also have included content and services to help quickly deploy spatial solutions. Now with these capabilities in place within the HANA platform, we have the ability to consume, store, process and analyse from various sources such as SAP data, non-SAP data, spatial data that can come from a variety of sources including geodata, real-time data streaming for machine equipment, assets as well as GIS data sources. What this means is that SAP HANA has the ability to access spatial data such as addresses, asset info, GIS info and real-time data. Combine this with the overall in-platform capabilities such as analytics, predictive text and spatial, you now have a unified platform to cover a range of use cases, scenarios and solutions. SAP HANA spatial capabilities are designed to support multiple use cases and scenarios. Spatial processing with SAP HANA supports analytical use cases by being able to combine business and spatial processing capabilities into one. It also supports GIS solutions by being another supported data layer, being able to push very complicated spatial queries into the SAP HANA in-memory platform for high-performing results. SAP HANA also provides the ideal platform for applications. These can be custom applications built by customers. They can also be applications developed by partners as well as SAP applications. Mobile devices can also take advantage of SAP HANA spatial capabilities. Mobile platforms are the ideal use case to provide real-time information and analytics to users in the field based on their actual location. Visualization is another key use case with SAP HANA. These can include visualization tools to render 2 and 3D objects. With the HANA XS engine, you can quickly and easily create spatial enabled solutions for applications including browser-based UIs or even mobile. So with this spatial ecosystem in place, companies can look for revenue opportunities based on location. Retailers can retain high-value customers and make location-specific offers. Insurance and credit card companies, for example, can identify potential fraud being committed in disaster areas. In gas or utility companies, you can identify and pinpoint assets. Marketing departments can improve customer interactions by providing real-time recommendations based on their specific location and government agencies can improve public safety and prepare for disasters. Manufacturing companies can use spatial to assist with product quality issues and telecommunication companies, for example, can identify cellular interruption areas and propose new power locations. So to summarise spatial processing with SAP HANA, we are providing it all. We have native spatial data types and functions in the in-memory platform and engine 
a unified modelling environment to build solutions that include analytics, predictive, unstructured, text and spatial, geo applications platform to quickly develop and deploy spatial applications, including an in-memory application, server and content and services. Also, SAP HANA has been highly optimised for spatial processing, requiring no additional indexes or reselection tables for performance purposes. And most importantly, all this is part of SAP HANA natively. So check out the technical guide on how to develop and leverage the SAP HANA Spatial App following the SAP Community Network link. The showcase of this Spatial App on SAP HANA has been developed by the SAP BusinessOne Solution Architects team and is for demonstration purposes only.